Welcome to interest.co.nz's morning briefing of what's news here and around the world. Everything you need to start the day in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. Starting now with more confirmation that the housing market is slowing. Figures from quotable value show house price growth in the three months to the end of February from a year ago slowed to 7.7% from 8.9% the previous month. QV says there are clear signs of a slowing in the market and it expects this to continue. QV stats are a bit of a lagging indicator because it dilutes the most recent figures inside a three-month period. The best indication of the most recent house prices will come later this week with REINZ figures for February. The first indication came last week when Auckland's biggest real estate agency group, Barford & Thompson, reported a 4.3% drop in prices and said sales volumes were down a third from a year ago at 600 for the month. The most interesting stat, though, from Barfoot was that 2,049 new houses came on the market in the month. Elsewhere, there's more signs that the global credit crunch is getting more serious. Late on Friday, the US Federal Reserve more than doubled the amount of cash it pumped into the overnight money markets to 200 billion US dollars. It is very worried about banks not lending to each other and the credit crunch. That was 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. I'm Bernard Hickey for interest.co.nz.